Jesus Christ, that's the big. <laughs> I'm your host, Nano. You know we're at the Brewhead, and today we got a brand new brewery to talk about. That's right, this is North Fork Brewing Company. I just hoping in Cambridge, it's actually just opened about three weeks ago, I want to say, two weeks ago. Um, but anyway, so you might notice something really good, but look how, look at it, look at it, look at the fucking thing. Like, you know, we've got the tall boy here, like, look at that, just a collection, okay? And, you know, like, even with the growlers and even a little one, like, it's so tiny and big. I just feel like another person holding a big hand, like, ah! Anyway, um, I really love the way they do this label, by the way. Um, so, obviously it's blank, so there's use a permanent marker to write down what beer it did, and, you know, don't be a G-Bay, or too bad, whatever. We talk about the can, and on the back it's actually playing what if this. This is actually a, a quality. So, this never left at home. Quality has the prepared quality of a loon. Like the ability to block out light and artists, Outwell provided a stable 100% recyclable container. 32 America outed and then 940 ML to the rest of the world. Um, so I actually really like this uh, label, pretty cool, pretty good idea. And um, right now they got three beer. Well, actually they got going to be four beer. Just the, uh, the Black IPA is coming out for ready right now. So, I got the Mocha Mask IPA, which we're going to review this one today. And the other one that I got is the um, Nanto uh, Clock, that's a Tossed Stout, 7.7%. And the other one is the Gobble IPA, it's uh, out of nowhere. Uh, it's about 9.3%. Uh, so, and the one really, really cool thing about it is that, um, so you go there, and man, they got a whole bunch of these, and they're actually open, and they fill it from the, you know, from the wall, and they just fill it up. Then they put in the crawling machine, and they go, and it's steel. That's it, match it, that's it, unreal. Um, so this one right here, this was uh, just a dollar, I believe, and the bigger one, the double IPA, was about ten dollars. And the uh, the top of the dog was stomach only. So really, it's uh, it's a good play for craft beers, you know, a local beer. And so anyway, let's get into this uh, Mostia Mostia Mast IPA. So let's do this. Uh, my job I'm gonna do this. The first time I started the can, I knew I was brewing until we were doing it, but personally, I never saw them myself. Um, I know red line judges, is it beyond the pale judges? Anyway, so, here we go. It's still a big ass can, like, I mean, it's just a freaking big can. And the, uh, the crew over there at North, North Fork is, uh, very nice people, very friendly, and they will talk about everything. They talk about beer with you, and you know, I just want to take it all in and just not really say anything. I just wanted to listen to them talk. And uh, anyway, my first time going there, and I won't be the last time I'm going. So I can't wait to see what else they'll be making. So let's talk about the beer. So, so this is uh, an IPA, six point two percent. And it's uh, a little bit clear, a little very, 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 very light um, unfiltered. So, oh no, there's no hay in the IPA. Uh, they're not IPA people. They mean that if there's no hay, uh, I don't know. There's some people out there that just kind of believe in the hay, you know. Hey, for Jay, yo, what you gotta do? Hey, for Jay. If it's not hazy, it might not be an IPA. But, 
Da 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 Easily go down, very smooth. Um, as soon as you start drinking it, you got that tropical tick. I'm doing little tiny stents of like pineapples and even though pineapple pops and tropical turkey, very light on the belly. And it's very crustable, so you can enjoy it on a hot summer day. And this is probably one of the, the belly IPA there is. And uh, very drinkable, very refreshing, and it's very light to enjoy. Yeah, like, it's just the right amount of balance, if you ask me. So, you know, it's not so. Hoppy, it's not so bitter, it's just right in the middle of, you know, that fine line, you know, and it's definitely trustable. And at that dip point two percent, that can be really dangerous. I mean, I'll probably finish the whole crawler and the other crawler tonight, but uh, this is definitely worth the money, like, this is worth the, uh, the $6 and in, in for tourists. And if you haven't been out to Tampere, so now you gotta go visit Barncast and North York. York. No, they North York. Anyway, so you gotta go to these two breweries in Tampere, because that's otherwise, don't tell us who might fit in brewery in Tampere. So, for this episode of the beer program, this boy, Mocha, Matt, IPA. Go test them out. Yeah.